He will leave through the door in which he came And bowed in shame against the blame Oh, the fight for his innocence was strong His unsung song was sung so wrong And so he hides Hi there folks, it's me David Reeman and welcome back to my channel. If you've just found my channel or you're wondering what I'm doing here, basically I started this in 2021, so basically last year, the beginning of last year. Obviously trying to build a channel is not an easy thing. Today we're going to talk about Man of Sorrow uh, from, our life, from the last Pink Cream 69 record from, um, as you probably guessed it, uh, Headstrong. Um, it's funny, I decided to talk about this track today because a friend of mine, living in Australia, I'm not going to mention any names, he donated so much money for, for <clears throat> to basically help making the solo record. And we were chatting a little bit and he lives in a very nice area in, in Sydney. And he mentioned that he's actually a British guy, like myself, uh, left the island I came over to this part of the world, lived in Germany for many years now in the Netherlands. And he went over to, to go and live in Australia. Probably a better job than me, unfortunately. I've got a good job, but he's better better, better paid, obviously more appreciated, you could say. Uh, living in a very amazing area in, in Sydney, very expensive, he said. And he was uh, driving around listening to this song really loud on a parking lot basically he'd gone shopping and he was listening to this song and it's a song that kind of gets gets forgotten in, in, in a way but it is a masterpiece it's a it's a, a dennis ward alfred koffler song without a doubt um very american as you could say the beginning of the track and the whole the whole thing um this is a track that started out um obviously with the music and anything could have happened. Obviously, with the strummy guitar, the open guitar at the beginning of the track, anything could have happened with this track. You know, let's have, let's have a quick listen, a little bit more of a listen to what what we did there. He will leave through the door the in which he came of uh, making the original it's strange in respect i mean it, it was it was not corona at that time but we still made in a way like a lockdown kind of video each to their own i was in my porch way there uh making a video real quick it was very late at night when i realized it was time to finally make this video so that frontiers could um make this this lyric video but is hope's the only tonic that still dries The days are lonely and the nights are desolate Uber looking great there, Chris in the practice room. It's different when you can actually go somewhere and you can come record Dennis in the studio. Um, it's different when you can actually go somewhere and, and do what you do in respect. I had really no choice. I could stand in the porch way. Uh, Uber looks great. He looks like he's on stage. Chris looks great. He got a, f a friend to film, I guess. And um, Frontiers made a really good job of uh, Uber there, of uh, make, making this lyric video, and it, it turned out great. You know, for what it is, but you know, it obviously was not Corona times, and and we'd made this video, me being of obviously in 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 the Netherlands, but we we got the best that we could out of it, and uh, you know, we needed something special for this this amazing track. Maybe you even realise that, of course, I'm reading lyrics a little bit. I think it was just like two or three months or maybe half a year before we'd actually finished making this record. These lyrics still stay in your mind, of course, but uh, you need a little bit of help along the way. And uh, 
I stuck the lyrics up somewhere on the wall and um, started to record it. Like I said, it was evening when I when I started to do this, when I realised that I was kind of late and it was time to finally get it done. And they, they really did. They really did, out of really nothing, made a, a great lyric video. And, um, yeah, which I'm obviously very appreciative of. This song could have been anything. And, and uh, Dennis Ward, I remember, he'd done quite often. He's a, he's a singer himself. As you know, and uh, great lyricist, producer, and he he would then do uh, uh, demos, you know, his own ideas, what he imagined. I think me and Coffler had done something for, for this. We'd done some kind of melodies, but Dennis came up with this new idea, which 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 we worked on for this track, and it just really set this this track on fire. I wouldn't say it's particularly a, a traditional Pink Cream '69 song, but uh, a song that's definitely celebrated and uh, appreciated in, in, in many ways, you know. So, um, like I said in my last video, we're finally getting out there. We just practiced recently and uh, the next gig will be on the 7th of July. Hope you enjoyed the video. Check out my t-shirt. This is from my latest solo record that will be out very soon. I've been collecting addresses from people that um, pledge money to make the record. We made this red record together. If you want to help a little bit more, you want to pick up this really cool t-shirt, you can find the link on my YouTube site or on my new website, and you can help support us in some way. Thank you for listening. My name's David Reedman. Adios! Still